What happens if we made a mistake and it turns out that we really shouldn't have performed the merge at all and we'd like to get the master branch back to the way it was before we did the merge? There's two ways to do this. So far, we haven't actually pushed our merged version of the master branch back to the repo. In this case, the easiest thing to do is just to pretend the merge commit never happened. The way we do that is we use git log to identify the commit immediately prior to the one we're trying to undo the merge from. Here's the merge commit up here, and the previous commit was this one. We'll just copy and paste that entire git commit ID, and then we'll do a git reset dash dash hard, which means throw away all changes that have occurred since that commit. And sure enough, the head of the repo is now at this older revision, and if we look at the movie.rb file, the merge change where we added a line to bring reviews in is now gone. On the other hand, if you had already pushed, it might be problematic to do a git reset because other people might have already pulled and gotten the merge commit. In this case, resetting will just create a historical discontinuity. In that case, what you can do is use git revert instead of git reset. The idea is the same, except that instead of throwing away the merge commit, it actually will create a new commit that looks just like the one that you specify on the command line. So it's the equivalent of having done the merge and then manually undoing the merge, but in a way that preserves history for everybody. So that's a summary of how to use the lightweight branching feature of Git to easily manage things like feature tracking branches in a way that doesn't interfere with other developers.